Uh, good morning. Um, it's early and I'm making my way down uh, to St. Catherine's Lighthouse on the southern tip of the Isle of Wight. Uh, 10 minutes or so uh, till the sunrise. Fantastic drive across um, <laughs> through a temperature inversion. And when I set off, it was totally dark. Uh, the moon was beautiful in the sky, absolutely cloudless. Then drove through some mists um, in some of the little valleys we've got here on the island. Uh, but it looks like it's absolutely cloudless morning. Uh, it's lovely to be out. And I'm hoping uh, to get some good shots. The, what I'm planning to do is I'm planning to go to the, if you like, my right hand side of the lighthouse so I can get a picture of the sun rising in the east uh, with the um, lighthouse in the foreground and then as the sun goes a little bit higher in the sky I'm thinking that perhaps moving to the other side of the lighthouse just to get it kind of bathed in a nice sort of early morning light I'll just show you the lighthouse as I make my way down this road it's uh, quite a sight Oh, this is, <laughs> this is unbelievable. Look, you can see the sun rising there on the horizon, the uh, lighthouse in the foreground. I've got to try and capture that, I think. And this amazing scene as the sun, a big red ball, now about, I don't know, three quarters of its way before becoming a whole ball and the lighthouse there in the foreground. Let's see what I can do with that. Gorgeous. Yeah. Lovely to be out, lovely to be trying to take this shot. Got the farm, the sky pretty cloudless, the sea relatively calm. Just the odd, the odd little bit of white as a, a gentle wave rolls over. Right at the southern tip of the Isle of Wight. The lighthouse, which was constructed after the Clarendon. So I think the 1830s, if my memory serves me right, uh, was lost around here. And it was thought the uh, lighthouse would be um, a good addition to this stretch of the coastline. Um, keep, keep ships away from the, the rocks that kind of um, protrude out a little bit from, from this southern tip. I'm standing at the top of the cliff. I don't really want to be too adventurous with what I'm doing. I was tempted to poke the uh, camera over the top of that, but some of these rocks are a bit, these ledges are a bit fragile. I don't really want to disappear over the, the side. You can see in the distance the cliffs of the needles actually, but I can, I don't, you probably can't from the camera in the very far distance. The waves just gently lapping against the shore. The sun coming up there. Right, I'm going to try and get that shot, I think. <laughs> um, a couple of friends, my teaching friends from uh, Doha, came to uh, visit a couple of years ago. And uh, when I used to bring school groups to St. Catherine's Lighthouse, uh, the lighthouse keepers would always ask them to kind of uh, uh, beware of the adders, the snakes uh, that you can get. In fact, I'm probably probably wise to be stomping through this kind of grass the way I am at the moment. Anyway, uh, one of my colleagues <laughs> didn't like snakes very much, so the amount of time we actually spent at the lighthouse uh, was limited because of that. Look at that. Can't really say fairer than that, can you? Beautiful morning. If you're watching this, Elizabeth, um, I haven't found any snakes yet, thankfully. Still time. 
maybe when I uh, set up this next shot, I'll have to be a bit careful. They don't jump out and bite me. I don't really want to waste this uh, lovely morning so what I'm going to do I think I'm going to take um, a shot kind of a bit further up the hill and uh, just freehand now that the the, the, uh, the light is kind of strong enough and then I'm going to wander around the coast a little bit and see if I can get any sort of shot maybe with the long lens of um, of west white from this this you'll only see glimpses of it but it looked like there might be quite a nice shot there so just to try and make the most of this glorious morning. As you, as you can probably tell, I still haven't totally given up on getting the shot of the sun <laughs> kind of coming through the uh, the light. So, uh, I don't know. It's kind of like atmospheric. So uh, thank you for joining me, it's been a lovely morning's photography, really enjoyed being out here, beautiful scenes, looks like it's going to be a glorious day, kind of mid-September 2020, um, we've stopped by an old, what looks like an old trick point or some sort of marker, it's uh, rotting away, eroding away, uh, I can see in the distance the needles, uh, Tennyson Down, the white chalk cliffs of Tennyson Down. I'll be going there in the not too distant future to maybe tomorrow evening to try and capture a sunset there. It looks absolutely marvellous in the, in the morning light. St Catherine's uh, Lighthouse behind me. Uh, lovely place to be. So if you've never been here, I encourage you to come and uh, visit. And um, I'll see you on the next one. Thank you.